Congratulations on the residency here in LA for the Buddy Vegan. Tell me a little bit about how it came about. I was in my bedroom and I'm like, I'm going to do a residency like how they do in Vegas. And the first one I'm going to do is in LA. Um, and I put this together in seven days. Wow. And here we are. We just knocked the line down. I was in the kitchen working, um, but we got a whole uh, one month residency happening in LA. I'm excited about it. Everybody's coming out. Um, it's star studded. It's just, it's amazing. I'm excited. It's been a pretty good turnout so far. Talk to me a little bit about, you know, the future of Slutty Vegan and how you would hope to see it expand from this point forward. World domination. <laughs> We got 14 locations and I plan on expanding and scaling and maybe one day franchising. But Slutty Vegan is the hottest concept in the country. There's no other, con except for my husband. He got a hot concept. But it, it ain't no other hottest concept um, other than Slutty Vegan. So I'm gonna just continue to open up locations, continue to scale. And then I might continue to do these residencies depending on how this is. There was recently a restaurant downtown Los Angeles that had some protesters, some vegan protesters, because it's a vegan restaurant and they decided to add animal-based products to the menu. What is your take on that? Do you think that was wrong with the restaurant or? That is a big no-no. Okay. You can't call yourself a vegan restaurant and then have stuff that's not vegan. It just, the math ain't mathing, okay? It started sounding like beef, cheese, all the different types the of The math products. don't math. And you know, you gotta be mindful of people that aren't intentional about opening up vegan restaurants. I really did this because this is who I am. A lot of people are doing it for the dollar and if it ain't working out for them, then they try to divert and go to, to the other thing that they're not even, um, confident or passionate about so I'm sticking you'll never see uh, beef or chicken as slightly vegan. Slightly vegan will always be uh, a vegan concept and we're gonna keep it that way.